Well, no surprise here. Black Friday, like everything else, will look different this year, and that may be permanent as more people are turning to online shopping. But for those wanting the full stand in line effect, you can still get it this year at stores big and small. Here's Ryan here. You won't see crazed customers barreling over any employees at mall entrances this year. In fact, many retail locations don't plan on opening until business hours on Black Friday. Even then, many of the doorbuster sales have disappeared, eliminating crowds. Everyone from the mom and pops to the big box stores have shifted to rolling out deals over the course of several weeks. And the push to online shopping, which grows every year, gets an even bigger boost in the pandemic, which Democratic Governor Jared Polis will appreciate as COVID cases continue rising in Colorado. There's another tradition that we're worried about coming up called Black Friday. Uh, the way that normally looks uh, is not a, a, a smart thing to do during the pandemic. Um, of course, the stores are open. People can shop. I hope they're having sales, but uh, make sure to follow those social distancing protocols at the stores. Refinitiv, a market data company, published surveys that show 74% plan on shopping online this year, up from the 50% who said they would last year. And while there are good deals out there, keep in mind that there are roughly 200,000 Coloradans on unemployment right now, two and a half times that of last year. The survey says 64% plan to spend less on Black Friday this year than last. If you shop online, do it soon. FedEx, UPS, even Amazon are all warning of potential shipping delays because of the pandemic and what could be the busiest e-commerce holiday shopping season ever. Also, don't forget about those local stores. Many of them are offering deals and curbside pickup. In Denver, I'm Ryan Herrer, 9 News.